Well, it's a wonderful sign. Broadway is back. Last night, the 75th Tony Awards returned to Radio City Music Hall for the first time yeah. since the pandemic to honor the best of live theater. A big deal. Yeah, yes, big very deal. big deal. Mm -hmm. And this is also a huge deal. A Maryland native took home a major Ooh. award. Miles Frost, who grew up in Rockville, Maryland, took home the award for best performance by a leading actor in a musical. He portrayed Michael Jackson in MJ the Musical. Now, he says the last Last time he did anything that MJ related was a high school <laughs> talent show. He was nervous at first about taking the role. Thanks to advice from his mother, smart guy and grandmother, <laughs> he decided to accept the challenge. My mother and my grandmother instilled in me that there's nothing I can't do. When I was when the opportunity was presented to me, had I said, "Oh no, you know I haven't done that in a long time. I don't think you know give it to somebody else that you know could probably do it better than me," I wouldn't be here. You know, I took the challenge. I feel like God presented me with this opportunity and this challenge, and who am I to turn that away? All right, that's a scene from last night's Tony. I mean, blew me away. Mm -hmm. Looked exactly like MJ. He was studying at Bowie State University before he dropped out to take this role on Broadway. Yeah, other big winners from last night, the Lemon Trilogy, that took home best play. A Strange Loop, that took home best musical. And then MJ took home three other awards last night, including best choreography. Wow, and Miles Frost, alma mater, Bowie State, reacting to the Tony news. They say when he received Broadway's top, highest honor, he became the youngest HBCU student wow. to win a Tony. And they believe the best is yet to come. That is it is. Frost was a 22 year old junior and budding music technology major before landing that starring role last year. The musical's producer says uh, he saw a high school YouTube video of him performing Jackson's hit Billie Jean. And All the right. rest was history. Well, and you know, I didn't even know about the show till I saw him do that and thought I got to get to New York and see yeah. that. Yes, so some do. other big winners from last night include Felicia Rashad, who won Best Actress in Play for her work in Skeleton Crew. And of course, we can't forget that Rashad is also the current dean of Howard University's College of Fine Arts. Mm -hmm. And this is probably my favorite moment. Jennifer Hudson joining the EGOT crew. She uh, won a Tony for co-producing A Strange Loop last night, which, as we mentioned, took home Best Musical. Wow. So right. many amazing shows, so many amazing talents there. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And at the beginning, as uh, Ariana DeBose said, the diversity yes. Yes. of not only who was in the audience, right. but the plays that are out there now. So Broadway yes. is back. Mm -hmm. It's not very far to get to New York. We need to do it. <laughs> we do need to do it. Yes, road trip. Mm -hmm. well,